Uh, I've never worked with a better team ever in my life in the wine industry. It's sorry for some of the old wineries to say that, but it's the truth. It's a great team. You know, the story of Jessup Sellers is, to me, a really inspiring one. Uh, it's really the story of these three families, uh, the uh, Thompsons, the Eisenmingers, and the Blues, who are all health professionals. And uh, uh, these just wonderful people who really bought this winery when it was uh, on life support. It was, it was down and out, and, and these guys bought it. And uh, when, they, uh, when they took it over, they did what they do during the day for their profession. They, they revived it, and that's what these guys do. When you first come into Jessup Cellars, you see uh, friendly people. You're always greeted with a, a smiling face, asking you about yourself, um, people that want to get to know you a little bit better, and people that want to make you happy. Wine moves people. Um, you know, a great, great meal turns into an extraordinary event when you have the right bottle of wine and the right people consuming it with you. So um, that's really where we like to take things. We um, only sell our wine here in the tasting room, so for us to be offering this wine through Cellar Angels is kind of unique for us, and, uh, and uh, you won't be finding it very often in any other place, so a uh, good opportunity to, to take advantage of it. Well, I think anyone that uh, has any success in life has an obligation, honestly, to share. Um, it isn't about uh, how much somebody can gather in their life uh, to myself and my partners. Uh, it's more about what you can do with it. So my first concert was The Grateful Dead. It was Jerry's last concert before he died in Vermont. My most memorable wine experience is probably uh, at the, the time that I got a chance to taste uh, 1959 Ingleduck. My favorite film, I'm, a, I'm kind of a western odor kind of guy. Um, uh, I like The Magnificent Seven a lot. My favorite musical band of all time is Van Morrison. Van the Man Morrison. And my children already know this, that uh, when I'm on my deathbed, that's the soundtrack they are supposed to be playing.